In this video, I'll explain how to switch from BBM Consumer to BBM Enterprise on a BlackBerry 10 device. I'll cover some of the key things you need to know and then demonstrate the entire process. A user may be required by their organization to switch to BBM Enterprise to provide secure communications. Here are some of the key things you'll need to know. Before the user begins to switch from the consumer version to the enterprise version of BBM, their BlackBerry ID must be entitled for BBM Enterprise. If this isn't configured, the customer must contact their BlackBerry administrator before they can proceed. BBM Enterprise is supported on the following BlackBerry 10 versions, 10.3.1, 10.3.2, and 10.3.3. You can only have one BBM app installed on your BlackBerry 10 device at a time. Although BBM Consumer and BBM Enterprise are separate apps, they must use the same app ID to integrate with core OS features like the hub and contacts. This means that you can have either the BBM Consumer app or the BBM Enterprise app installed, but not both. In BlackBerry world, there's only one listing for BBM and you use this listing to download BBM. The switch between the Consumer version 10.x and the Enterprise version 20.x is done within the BBM app. I'll show you how this works in the demo. When you switch to BBM Enterprise, all of your chat history is permanently deleted. For groups, the enhanced group features are no longer available. This includes both calendar and tasks. After the switch, all previous group chats are deleted and users are no longer members of those groups. Also, while BBM Enterprise is activated, they can't rejoin the groups unless they switch back to the consumer version of BBM. For more information on how groups work in BBM Enterprise, swipe down from the top of the BBM Enterprise screen and tap Help. Some of the BBM consumer features are not supported in BBM Enterprise. BBM channels are not supported. BBM Shop is also not available in BBM Enterprise. All previously purchased stickers, subscriptions and such are no longer accessible. Broadcast message sending is not supported. Dropbox and payment partner apps are also not supported, for example, PayPal. However, if the user switches back to the BBM consumer version, all of their previously purchased stickers, subscriptions, channels, and groups are restored. All right, let's look at how it all works. To make the switch to BBM Enterprise, both BBM and BlackBerry World must use the latest versions available, so let's update those first. On your home screen, tap the BlackBerry World icon, tap Settings, and then tap My World. Tap My Apps and Games. Look for BBM and BlackBerry World in the list. Normally, since I'm already here, I would update both apps, however, during the switch process, BBM automatically checks to make sure BlackBerry World is updated. So for this demo, I'm just gonna update BBM so you can see how the app performs the check and the update for BlackBerry World. Once the update for BBM is complete, you can tap the Installed tab, find BBM in the list and tap Open, or you can return to the main screen and tap the BBM icon to open it. For the demo, I'm gonna tap the BBM icon on the main screen. The consumer and enterprise versions of BBM will show different icons on the home screen. The current icon is the consumer version. All right, from the top of the screen above the viewing area, swipe down to access additional options. Tap settings. Swipe up until you find the switch to BBM enterprise button. I'll tap it to start the switch process. A warning will show letting us know that the chat history is gonna be deleted. Any stickers and subscriptions that were purchased are no longer available, and the enhanced group features are also no longer available. I'll tap Continue. Okay, this is where BBM automatically performs a check to make sure BlackBerry World is up to date. So we'll tap Download. BlackBerry World opens and takes you to the BlackBerry World listing. We'll tap Update and wait for the update to finish. Tap BBM. Now BBM Enterprise is downloading and installing. Once the installation is complete, the BBM app will automatically close. 
Next, we'll need to switch our BBM account over to BBM Enterprise. Now that BBM Enterprise is installed, you can see that the icon on the main screen is updated to use the BBM Enterprise icon. We'll tap it to open it. I mentioned earlier that users can get back all of their previously purchased stickers, their subscriptions, channels, and groups if they switch back to the consumer version of BBM. Let's look at how to do that now. We'll swipe down and tap the settings icon. We'll swipe up on the screen until we find the Deactivate BBM Enterprise button. You'll see a warning saying that your chat history will be deleted and that your chats will no longer be protected with additional BBM Enterprise security. We'll tap Continue. BlackBerry World opens to the BBM listing page and installs the consumer version of BBM. The listing page may initially say open, however, just wait a few seconds to allow the installation to begin. You'll be able to see the installation progress at the top of the screen. Once the installation is complete, you can tap open here or you can tap the BBM icon on the main screen. For the demo, I'll tap the icon on the main screen. Notice that the BBM icon is switched back to the consumer icon now. When BBM opens, we'll tap switch BBM to complete the switch. And that's it. All right, let's review the important things you need to remember. The BlackBerry ID must be entitled for BBM Enterprise. You can only have one BBM app installed on your BlackBerry 10 device at a time. BBM Consumer and BBM Enterprise are separate apps, but use the same application identifier to integrate with core OS features. There's only one listing for BBM and BlackBerry World on BlackBerry 10 devices. The switch between them is done in the app. All chat history is deleted when you switch. For groups, the enhanced group features are no longer available. This includes calendar and tasks. After the switch, all previous group chats are deleted and users are no longer members of those groups. While BBM Enterprise is activated, they cannot rejoin the groups unless they switch back to the consumer version of BBM. The following consumer features are not supported in BBM Enterprise. BBM Shop. Paid stickers and subscriptions are not available in BBM Enterprise, but if you switch back to the consumer version, you'll be able to access them again. Channels are not supported. Broadcast message sending is not supported. And Dropbox and Payment Partner app support is not available. Some minor additional items no longer available include feed content blocking, show what I'm listening to, private chat, and share my pin. For more information about the features of BBM Enterprise for BB10, swipe down from the top of the BBM Enterprise screen and tap Help.